हेलो स्टूडेंट्स वेलकम बैक टू माय चैनल टू इसको क्वेश्चन सॉल्व डी क्यूब वाई बाई डी एक्स क्यूब माइनस टू इन डी स्क्वायर वाई बाई डी एक्स स्क्वायर माइनस थ्री इन डी वाई बाई डी टू जी जिसे होमोजेन लीनर डिफरेंशियल इक्वेस हो फर्स्ट सॉल्यूशन देन राइट द गिवेन इक्वेशन इज गिवेन इक्वेशन इज डी एक्स डी वाई डी क्यूब वाई डी एक्स क्यूब माइनस टू इंटू डी स्क्वायर वाई बाई डी एक्स स्क्वायर माइनस थ्री इंटू डी वाई बाई डी एक्स इज इक्वल टू जो दिस इज गिवन इक्वेशन ओके सो नाउ नाउ राइट इन राइट इन सिम्बॉलिक फॉर्म सिम्बॉलिक फॉर्म मीन symbolic form means what will happen instead of d by dx we write instead of d by dx we write capital d capital d okay so here become d cube y d cube y minus 2 d square y minus 3 d y is equal to 0 okay in this we take y common so become d cube minus 2 d Two d square minus three d four into y equal to zero. When the when y is go to here, it will become thus the equation is d cube minus two d square minus three d is equal to zero. Now right now write in auxiliary form. Write in auxiliary auxiliary Form auxiliary form means instead of d we put m. It will become m cube minus two d m square minus three m is equal to zero. <coughs> sorry, here two m square. Okay, sorry. So at last we can take m as common here. So we got m into m square minus two m minus three. Equal to zero. Now we uh, here we send this m here it will become zero. So let our here our m one value is zero. Okay, this is m one. I'm taking this m one. Okay. Now let the left over equation m square minus two m minus three is equal to zero. Now here I'm using factorization method to find the roots. Okay, we have to find the m two and m three value. Okay, here. So here we are. I'm doing middle term splitting means uh, multiplying the la first term and last term. And uh, making this the uh, this equation okay so minus three we have to find minus three minus three if uh, we can write as uh, uh, three ones are okay instead of that we can I can write plus three into minus uh, plus three no no sorry minus three into plus one okay so it will become m square minus three m plus m Minus three is equal to zero. Okay, this is a factorization method. Okay, after that, what you have to do? Take here m common. M common means m into m minus three. Okay, then here what you take common plus one. We can take common plus one common m minus three. Okay, now we can take m minus three common. Here, so our factors is m minus three minus three and m. Plus one equal to zero is equal to zero. Okay. After that, uh, separately equate this function with zero. Okay. So last, what will become m minus three equal to zero. M plus one is equal to zero. That become here it become m is equal to three. M is equal to one. At last, what you have to do? Uh, this is m two. This is m three. We find the roots. Okay. Now we are doing uh, here minus one. Okay. Now we Now we have to write the one case. Which case are the roots are real? Right here, the roots roots are real. Real means real number and distinct. Distinct means different. Okay, distinct, distinct. Then the general solution is. General solution or different solution, both are the same. General solution 
is is y is equal to c1 e1 e power m1 x plus c2 e power m2 x plus c3 e power m3 x instead of uh, m1 we have to substitute the values of m1 okay m values so plus c1 what is e power m1 is 0 we, m, we take an m1 as 0 okay we have taken m common no okay the bigger e power 0 x plus c2 e power m2 what we have got 3 they become 3 x m2 is 3 and here x okay then plus c 3 e power what is m3 minus 1 minus minus 1 minus 1 into x means here become at last our answer is e power 0 e power 0 means 0 only okay e power into x means is equal to 0 so it becomes c1 plus c2 e power 3x plus here e c3 e power minus x okay this is our answer thanks for watching